Hey guys. Hello. Hello. Who's that? That's Tammy. Oh yeah, she's still here? Yes. Whatever. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Sleep deprived. So you guys just got off an airplane. Yes. And you've been up for like two days. It was horrible. Well, no, the trip was fun, but the plane was horrible. I don't know how people do it. I had to entertain myself while you guys were gone. Yes. And we opened that box the other day, and Dino sent us that uh, flashlight. Yes. And he said I had to hack it. Yes. So I it? did. This right here uh -huh. is the laser beam. Oh my gosh. Out of the inside of that flashlight. Fire the laser. So <laughs> here what we have is a propeller, uh -huh. microcontroller, and it's uh, got six pins on it that are turning on then off one at a time in a row, okay. sequentially. Yeah. All right. And those are tied into six different resistors here, two of which are variable. Yeah. It's also tied into these uh, LEDs that are in this, and it's just to animate to show where it is. They're not really doing much of anything except just displaying. Mm -hmm. So these are six different resistors of six different uh, values, but the pins all output the same voltage. So depending on which pin is on, a different resistor is being used. So a different voltage is coming out to this side. Okay. This is a 555 timer oscillator chip here. And I've got it set up in a voltage controlled format. So that means depending on the voltage, it outputs a different tone. Okay. So if a different pin turns on, different resistor, different tone. Okay. The output of that 555 is going through this LED, just to use it as a diode, and it's controlling this transistor. Mm -hmm. The transistor is switching 5 volts on and off, to laser, so it's turning the laser on and off rapidly according to the frequency that's being output by the 555. Cool. Now, that's a lot more complicated than it needs to be, but the basic idea is here is that I've created a simple uh, step sequencer, so it'll play a note, then a different note, and a different note, and a different note, and it just goes around and around in a circle. And you can see this very easily with the camera. This blinks mm -hmm. with the frequency. This is showing which step it is on and the laser beam is blinking right along with the LED. Okay? Yeah. Now, for the fun part. Yeah. This laser beam is shooting off in that direction, off of a mirror. The mirror is angled so that it goes downstairs, and there's something downstairs that we're gonna go check out. All right, so here we are, we've moved downstairs. We've got the mirror is way up there, and uh, the desks are up there, and it's got the laser on it. And you can see the laser illumination on this. This is a big solar panel. I'll show you the circuit here so you can see there's no funny business. Positive and minus here to the rails on the breadboard. And that is a jack. So the only thing attached to this amplifier is that solar panel. Cool. Not going to be loud. It's not. <laughs> Doing strong bed over there. <laughs> so that's what I did to entertain myself while you guys were gone. That's cool. I'm transmitting analog audio over laser beams. Oh, so our base R belong to us. <laughs> so hey, the laser beam is changing the voltage. Yeah. It's it's causing the solar cell to create some sort of voltage which then is transferred to the amplifier or whatever. That's awesome. It turns it back into audio, demodulates it in other words. Cool. I like it. Any further questions? I think I'm good, but that's really cool. I like solar cells. They're yeah. very fun. So uh, this is similar to uh, a project that Mark Van de Wettering of the Brain Wagon blog was working on, but he was using LEDs on both ends of it. Uh -huh. And uh, I thought I'd try it with a laser beam with pulsed width modulation instead of uh, current limiting modulation okay. and obviously got good results on this and yeah. the range that I would be able to get with a laser is just crazy. Mark and I were chatting last night about bouncing it off one of the uh, panels that they left up on the moon. Oh, no You way. get a big enough laser and you could bounce it off the moon <laughs> and 
back to okay. somebody else across the country. Now the only thing is how big does this laser have to be? And well, you put on it's a, a high list? wattage laser. <laughs> but uh, yeah, how that quickly would be... How would the feds be at your house? <laughs> Actually, it's not regulated at all. So you can oh. do it without any worries. And now that you've said that in three months, we're going to see some sort of regulation. It's going to be men in black. <laughs> all right. Anyway, I think we're pretty much out of time on the recording. So cool. until next time. Bye. Bye. We post videos all the time, so don't forget to subscribe. And follow us on Twitter at TYMKRS.